In the last class, we talked about 3D transformation and moving from local space to world space. In this class, we are going to talk about view space, clip space, and screen space. The objects in the world space can be viewed from different angles. For example, we can place the camera on front, top, bottom, or sides, or at specific angles. Here, you can see the top view of the two objects after transformation to the view space. View space is also called as eye space or camera space. Viewing the exterior through a window can best explain the transformation from view space to clip space. This is similar to placing the objects in view space into the rectangular window of the world visible through a computer monitor. Some objects like the boundary wall in the picture shown here gets clipped. Some of the plants which falls within the boundary of the viewing window is included within the clip space and are shown completely while some of the other objects like the gate and the kennel on the left and right sides of the viewing window gets discarded. Screen space converts clip space objects to pixels on the screen. The screen may be 1920 or 1080 for a laptop or 480 cross 900 for a mobile phone. The pixels are the dots on the screen, which lights up the screen and which shows the objects on the screen. In the next section, we'll talk about orthographic projection, perspective projection, and frustum.